this is a tough journey, you know. <laughs> so on the New Cuisine Show, we have invited a very special guest all the way from the UK and also he's a Ghanaian as well. And I'm happy to have him on my New Cuisine Show. So Jason, what are you going to prepare for us on the New Cuisine Show? So, of course, we have exhausted all of our energy, so I'm actually going to make one of my favorite protein okay. shake. Protein shake, okay. Shakes. Okay. Uh, that has all the vitamins, protein, mm. everything we need. We need a strength, for, you know. For, for such a journey. Yeah, so, yeah that's what I'm going to do. So wow. stay tuned. Yeah, so guys, as he said, stay tuned. Don't go anywhere. Stay glued to your seat. We have more for you on the New Cuisine Show. This is your boy Kevin McCoy and Jason Bratton. See ya. Yo guys, we are here once again inside the Nude Cuisine Kitchen and I'm here with my brother Jason Boateng and he promised to make us a um, protein shake. So Jason, I want you to introduce your fruits to us because I can see fruits here, yeah, different kinds of fruits and milk. I don't know, you know, so you have to introduce them to us. Yeah, so mm -hmm. um, this is actually something I do every single morning. Okay. This is what I do. Um, Every time on my way to work, I make this as a protein shake. Healthy living. <laughs> yeah, I try and live as healthy as possible. I try and eat because you are what you eat. Mm -hmm. Have you heard that saying? No, no. You, <laughs> you are, are what, what you, you eat. eat. So if you eat rubbish, don't expect, you're on your to own. See, <laughs> <laughs> don't expect to see good results. Yeah. So uh, this is something I make every morning and I'm going to show you um, mm -hmm. actually how to make it. Okay. It's very basic really. It's about choosing your own fruits that you actually enjoy. Okay. Um, today we have grapes, grapes, we have bananas, bananas. we have apples. Right. Um, as you can see, they're different colors. But um, why did you decide to choose red apples? Yeah, I mean, I could have gone with green, but then mm -hmm. all the fruits would have been one color. Okay. By the time you blend it, it doesn't look attractive. It tastes oh, kind of so you want um, it to be more colorful. Yeah, That's and I great. found like the red ones are a bit more matured and okay. they don't have a bitter aftertaste. Okay. So then the shake actually comes out nicer. And um, then we have musla. This is okay. something that people actually have for breakfast. We I love it. it. Yeah. Yeah. So I I put that in the shake to mm -hmm. give it a nice texture and, and actually make it. Great. A heavy, mm. it can actually last you all the way till lunchtime. That's great. So it's good. And I can and see milk here also. Yeah, the milk, it's your choice. I use almond milk. Some people like to use soya. Some mm. people like to use um, oatmeal milk. Okay. All sorts of different types. But of you milk. think almond milk is better almond than the other? Is definitely the most healthiest in my opinion. Okay. It has the least calories, the least sugar. Mm -hmm. This is what I use. And even with the almond milk, there are different types. There's the sweetened mm. one. And there's an unsweetened. I definitely use the unsweetened. Unsweetened one. It's much That's healthier. Okay. Um, then yeah, we have ice that we're gonna blend okay. everything together. together. Okay. So literally just throwing everything into the blender, watching the blender do its thing, <laughs> pouring into the cup and enjoying it. Okay. Okay. Once you put everything inside the blender, you know the sound of the blender, you know. So we will just leave him to do whatever he's doing, and then we will get back to you and ask Jason some few questions about his brand because he's a brand himself he is a big brand a fashion designer you know and i'm very happy to have him here on the new cuisine show so guys don't go anywhere the show still continues love you
my fruits, my milk, my ice, my musla, and I just blended it all together. And now we, we're gonna call on Mr. Kevin himself to come and have a taste and see if he likes it. Yes, I'm here. <laughs> I, I need you to be honest. Okay, I'm gonna be honest. <laughs> like, don't like it, this is very honest. healthy and I'm gonna be honest with you. Yeah. And whilst we are doing the tasting, yeah. I have some questions set here for you. So I have some numbers here and I have my question on my screen, like on my phone. Okay. So you select one of these questions from the bowl here. And okay, selected number one. Okay, let me put this one here. Selected number one. I'm being honest about the taste. You also have to be honest about the question as well. <laughs> as a fashion designer, you know. Okay. Yeah. So you are a fashion designer. You very like an expert yep. in fashion. What does that even mean as a fashion designer and being an expert in fashion? Okay. So I'm a fashion designer. I have okay. a women's wear brand and it's my name, Jason Wharton. Um, nice. I live in London, but my brand is more based in America and Africa. It's all around, basically. Around. Wow. Um, a fashion expert. I used to have a segment mm -hmm. on a TV show in London, and I was a fashion expert. Okay. They would ask me, what do I think about what somebody was wearing? wearing. What would they have done better? Okay. Advice on what people should wear to carnival, or stuff like that. It was yeah. a segment I had. So mm -hmm. that, that's what makes me a fashion expert. Oh, that's me. great. Yeah, but yeah, that's so that's great. What How do people make money out of being a fashion expert like to be an expert in fashion how do people make money out of it i think um being a fashion expert you can there's so many different ways you can make money so okay people like to go into the styling mm -hmm. part of things okay. some people like to make clothes okay um, other people are the creatives behind the oh. scenes on uh, so many video shoots and stuff like that wow. so there's so many different because movies. if i look on your page oh my god like from head to toe everything is perfect like everything is perfect there is no mistakes i love fashion as well and you someone who inspires some people like us on social media everywhere and also make it happen for ourselves as yeah. well so to have you here for you to explain to people watching it also you know it's a big deal yeah. so you know <laughs> it's a big deal yeah so let's move on to the next question okay um uh, three okay let me put this one here so that i don't mix them up um was it difficult to make a decision to be a style expert as an african and since we are mainly used to the usual traditional jobs how did your family take it when you told them? Because you know, where we are from, our parents always want us to be the doctor, lawyers. engineer, lawyers and all that. When you channel it to fashion, what did they say about it? My family was actually very happy, uh, very supportive. Um, okay. My mom has always known I was into like fashion and okay. I, I used to make clothes. She would always ask me mm -hmm. what should she wear to church and stuff okay. like that. So, Everyone has known I've had style and liked that part of me. Okay. Plus, I come from a very creative family anyway. My father, oh. my, my dad was an architect. Oh, okay. You know, my mom was a dressmaker at one point also. Oh, so I okay. I quite understand a creative now. Family, so they were they were very receptive. As long as mm. I was making money, and I was going to get it, of course. I was going to get out of their house <laughs> <Yeah>. very soon. <laughs> yeah. Was, yeah. So they, they were receptive of it. I think everyone should really follow their passion. Mm -hmm. rather than money because if you follow money you are going to find yourself not enjoying okay. the job you're in that's great so, yeah. follow your passion but not <laughs> the Not money the time, yeah. yeah so we are going to move on to the other question but before we move on to the other question you have a very nice beard right. very curly right. how do you make it because on social media some people also know you for, for your beard. of course yeah. for your beard so yeah. how did that came up i don't know i've always had a beard but mm -hmm. recently i've been growing it out okay. the more i grow it out the more people seem to be going crazy some people um broke me on social media why because they asked me are they that, jealous <laughs> <laughs> they asked me what am i using mm -hmm. and when i say nothing they were like i will try one too much and they just start blocking me ah, I know so now i don't feeling. i don't actually use much i actually just use shea butter mm -hmm. yeah and i actually naturally have straightish hair okay so i just use my hands and twist it to, a bit to with twist shea it. butter 
That's it. Wow. Because it's very nice. Because it's very nice, you know. Yeah. Beard is the new thing going on now, and I always pray that I get why I'm <laughs> messed up, and, you know. <laughs> so, does what you eat at home yeah. makes your beard grow faster? Or I what? think yes. Having a lot of like vitamins and protein in your system is good for your nails. It's good okay. for your hair. It's good for your skin. Mm -hmm. So I really do think, as I said earlier on, you are what you eat. You are what you so eat. If you're eating junk and you expect mm -hmm. to have like clear skin and good hair and good nails, it's not gonna happen. It's gonna, so okay. you are what sure. you eat. You need That's to great. Eat healthy and good. you are what you eat for sure you've said it again <laughs> you are what you eat okay so just you're gonna move on to our last question okay. and then we talk about the food <laughs> okay okay good um what is your proudest career moment so far ah uh, i've had a, a lot i've been very lucky um to have a good pr team and my okay. PR team is in LA, mm -hmm. and so as a very young African man, okay. I've been in very amazing positions and places. Okay, like my brand has been on people like Tiana Taylor, Tony, Tony Braxton. Oh, um, Tony Braxton! Yeah, so so, so many wow. big names have worn my stuff. Um, people from Empire, C Sierra from Empire, so many oh, really? really, really big opportunities wow. have come my way. Um, That's great. Dress people for the, globing, uh, for the Golden Globes in America. Um, yeah, so those That's are great. my proudest moments. When you know, good cuisine always bring you, you know, <laughs> great people all over the world and then you get to know to be inspired as well. Yeah, it's not all about food, it's not about your sexiness or whatever it is, it's about inspiring other people as well. Oh, yeah, that's gosh. great, that's great, yeah. and that's great. So let's talk about your so protein now, shake. Mm -hmm. You need to taste. This yeah. is my protein shake. As I said, it has the bananas, mm -hmm. it has the apples, the grapes, the almond milk, yes. ice. And most importantly, the musla, mm -hmm. and I blend it all together. So I need you to taste. I've already tasted it, so I'm gonna do the re uh, tasting. <laughs> <laughs> Actually, it's nice. I love it, guys. This is not for the camera. Are you being honest? I'm being honest. It's good, right? right? It's really it's good. good. It's for I'm gonna do it every day, like it's all the what time. I do for breakfast and it's really, really good. Is it actually um, healthy for me to eat it every day? Of course. You're eating nuts. You're eating fruits. Okay. <laughs> you're eating almond milk. Okay. Everything here is healthy. It's very nice. It tastes very healthy, and yeah. If you have any more left, mm -hmm. if you have like a protein jar like this, and you just put what you have left. And just be sipping on it. Sipping on it till lunchtime and you're good. Okay. Okay. And so it's really, really, really And healthy. I'm loving this cup. Yeah. <clears throat> Is it Young Pablo? Young Pablo. It's, Young Pablo, it's, okay. It's Dapped Clothing. It's Dapped a, Clothing. It's, it's a brand in London that sponsors and gives me hats and yeah, this is oh, a okay. gift to you. That's, that's, that's great. Yeah. I, I love it. It's, I can't, they're, they're pretty mm -hmm. big, so it covers everything. Everything. Yeah, yeah that's great. You can go on their site, mm -hmm. and they have so many different types. So, his handle is going to be right there, Dapper okay. Clothing. And this is one of his brands, yeah. Young, uh, Young Pablo. Pablo. Yeah, Young Pablo. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> you have so to sponsor the new cuisine, new cuisine show. Cuisine show. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, please sponsor us. Dapper Clothing, sponsor the new cuisine show. We wait on you, yeah. So, guys, um, I'm actually enjoying this um, protein shake made by Jesse Button. It's very healthy, and I want to do it more at home, like very often. You can also make it. It's very simple. It's a very simple recipe. You just need your um, apples. You need your banana, grapes, almond milk, and that is it. Yeah, and ice, and yeah, then good to go. Thank you, Jason, for coming on the New Cuisine it's Show. Great. I appreciate you so much for spending time with us, bro. It's been, it's been a pleasure, man. It's yeah, pleasure. thank you so much. Thank you so much. And don't forget to subscribe to our YouTube channel, Koi Fitness, the New Cuisine Show. And if you're having any difficulties to find us on YouTube, visit my Instagram handle. And in my bio, there is a link there. Tap on the link, and it's going to direct you to my YouTube channel. Thank you very much once again. It's a beautiful Sunday. Enjoy the show and we are out. <laughs> bye bye.